Hi, this is Mato. In this video, I will show you the game between Angel and so if Angel is on one side, who is on the other side? On the other side is Bush game. This game was played in New York in 1940. Angel had white pieces and he started at e4. Bushke played knight to f6, Alehi in defense. e5, attacking the knight. Knight to d5, knight to f3. d6, d4. Bishop to g4, pinning the knight. Unpinning. c5, trying to destroy white center. Angel castled kingside. Queen to b6, attacking the pawn on b2. That means that white, dark square bishop, must stay on c1. The problem with this move is that black is neglecting the development of his kingside. White to move. What would be the plan for white in this position? Have a good look. Opening files and catching a black king before castling comes to mind, doesn't it? So this is the logical move. E takes on d6. E takes on d6. Rook to e1, lining the rook with black king. Black king is already feeling the cold wind in his hair. Bishop to e7. Bishop to c4 attacking the knight. Black would love to castle, but it doesn't work because of bishop takes knight. Knight to f6 would be the best move under circumstances. In a panic mode, black captured the knight on f3. With this move, black is only helping white to bring the strongest piece in the game. Attacking the knight second time and eyeing the pawn on f7. Knight to f6. Knight to c3. Knight to c6. Knight to d5. Attacking the queen. Queen to d8. Well, knight takes knight comes to mind, doesn't it? If knight takes knight, bishop takes knight, and black can't castle because of bishop takes knight on c6, following with rook takes bishop. So perhaps then, in this position, rook to f8 defending the pawn on f7 would be the best, but then bishop to g5. Seeing all this, Bushke played a queen to d8. White to move. We have reached the most interesting position of the game. Please pause the video and find the best move for white. Did you pause? What did you find? Like it or not? We are going to have a drum roll. Are you ready? Kaboom. Did you see this move? Bishop is pinned. So pawn takes screen. Knight takes pawn, check. King to f8, and there is checkmate in one. Bishop to h6, checkmate. What a fantastic combination. And let's go back to move 13 again. This is the position. Did you see the killer move in this position? Did you see checkmate in three? If you did, congratulations. And that is all. I hope that you enjoyed watching this video. I wish you good luck with your king hunt. And bye for now.